Good morning, Miss Cuna High School. Live from our TV studio, would you please stand for the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, everyone. Again, a special thanks to all our students for participating yesterday in Halloween, and thank you again for all your cooperation. It was a great day. Uh, no issues. I had a, a great time watching all the uh, events and have to find out who won some of the contests. Now for your announcements. Uh, the following students should report to Ms. Bushy in the Counseling Center at this time. Kevin Martinez, Kelsey Lenny, Jillian Macri, and Thomas Haran. Would you folks please see Ms. Bushy now? A lot of powder puff announcements. Let's start with powder puff uh, t-shirts available today at Crossroads. The cost will be $10. Senior powder puff players, you're going to have a practice tomorrow at 1.45 p.m. before the powder puff game. And the junior versus senior powder puff game is set for 2.30 tomorrow on the football field. Come out and support your team. The admission, the cost for admission is $2. And our final announcement here, are you interested in politics? Do you have a strong opinion and have a desire to express it to others? Then join the Politics and Current Events Club. We'll debate, discuss, and learn about world issues as well as play games. You can come to Mr. Matice's classroom, which is C460 on Tuesday, and express your political side. Hope to see you there. Any questions, see Mr. Matice in his classroom or in the Social Studies Resource Center. And now let's turn it over to our student reporters. Thank you, Principal Rickert. Good morning, Ms. Skiuna. Today is Friday, November 1st. I hope everyone is recovering from Halloween yesterday. I'm Allie. And I'm Kat. Here's what's making news around the school. In club news, tonight is monologue night on behalf of Drama Club. All are welcome to come to the Little Theater at 6.30 to hear classic and comedic monologues, as well as some movie monologues. Admission is free. There will be baked goods for sale to support the Drama Club, so we'll see you there tonight at 6.30. And I'll be on stage performing Jane Eyre. I think you'll like it. Also in club news, Ms. Game is coming up, and Nixon Save needs volunteers. Please see Ms. Salvin in the Social Studies Resource Center if you'd like to help out. Speaking of Nix, it is time for the year's Fruit Cup Drive for Equinox. Nix is hoping to collect 1,500 fruit cups. Please bring your donations to C446 with your homeroom written on each cup. Anyone interested in attending this year's Relay for Life, the all-night fundraiser, held on our track for the American Cancer Society, should come to a meeting in the Old Cafe 6 p.m. on Monday, November 4th. That's this coming Monday. The music department reminds anyone who ordered a Smith's Pie as part of the Friends of Music fundraiser that pickup is today from 3 to 6 p.m. in the new calf. And congratulations to Sasri Sherokumali for, for being second runner-up in the Festival, Na Festival of Nations held, on, held at the Egg in Albany this past weekend. In other news, if you and four friends are in a club and want to bowl for kids' sake later this year, see your club advisor or Mrs. Nunez in the counseling center. The science department reminds everyone to use the gray composting buckets placed around the school. Most organic matter, apple cores, fruit skins, and vegetable remnants should go in these buckets. This organic matter is then brought to the compost pile near the school's greenhouse and used as part, as the, part of the soil for the horticult horticultural club to grow vegetables next year. The art department has been running the Best of NISC Art Show displaying works from grades K to 11. It's going on now until November 6th in the NISC Art Gallery. Later in November, the exhibition will change, so be sure to pass through the NISC Art Gallery to look for your art and your classmates. Speaking of art, there is an art show called Teachers as Artists, a showcase of creativity, and it's being held at the Teachers Union office in Latham. And our very own art director, Mr. Walrath, and our photo and video teacher, Mr. Haneke, work, Haneke's works are displayed. Congratulations. Now it's time for today's lunch menu. And again, the Broadcasting Club asked another TV legend. This time, it's Dick Vitale to give us the menu. Roll the clip. I'm Dick Vitale. Here's the lunch menu. Breakfast for lunch, baby. French toast steak, sausage patty, hash browns, apple cider, baby. Here are two important reminders. One, again, this year Mr. DeCesar's TV class will have live news on BD Days. And two, turn your clocks back an hour before bed Saturday night. That's an extra hour of sleep. Also, I have two reminders. Remember to watch the clips on TV during the day today to see, so, to see many of the great costumes from Halloween yesterday. And the powder puff 
football game is at 2.30 tomorrow. Junior team has practiced at 11.30 on the football field. Bring your mouth guards. You can't play without them. Enjoy your weekend.